For this video, you'll be needing density foam or you could use whatever foam you have, but mine is from joannes.com. And you'll be needing fabric paint. Any other paint will crack when you paint your squishies, but you could also choose to mix some acrylic paint with the puffy paint. You need scissors and you'll also be needing something to paint with. Starting off with a rectangle, we're gonna cut it diagonally and this is gonna become Link's hat. Then for the face, there's no really any steps towards getting it, but I just like to eyeball it. So I'll just start off by rounding off the bottom of the face. Like that, and then I'll just start rounding off the top part too. And then after you get that circle, you just want to keep curving it so that it looks more like a face. And you could also start creating the bangs that Link has and I'm just gonna cut it diagonally for that. Like so, and then I just cut the face out once again. It's hard to see on camera but I kind of cut out the details of the bangs and I'm just gonna color in the details later. And now moving back to the hat. So now you want to create a point at the end of the hat because the hat is pointed. Like so. And you could continue slimming down the hat. After you have cut the point, you want to flip it over and start cutting a dent in it. This is so that it will distinguish between the face and the hat. And you also want to round it off at the bottom. And make sure to cut out the ears as well and I also indented right here so you could distinguish between the face and the hat. So next I'm gonna be creating the body and you want to grab another rectangle sponge but a tinier one. This is just gonna be the body and legs, the arms I'm gonna cut separately but for now you want to create a triangle, just a small one. And then you're gonna cut out a little bit of the side. And just like that you have a body. So now grab your body and compare it to your head and just adjust the body to what size you want it to be. I want mine to be short so I'm going to cut off the top a little bit. And then you could adjust it to be skinnier as well and you want to round it off so that it looks like a body you now. And you just do that by cutting the rough edges. Here is my finished body and you want to glue that down with some fabric paint and I'm using the white puffy paint. Next we're cutting the arms and the arms are pretty self-explanatory. You just need a rectangle and just smooth that out and it'll be an arm. After you're done rounding it off, you want to cut a diagonal line on it so that you'll be able to glue it down to your body. and. You just want to glue it down like that. This is optional but I created props with it, a shield and a sword. And sorry I didn't show how to make it because it didn't really turn out good anyway. So now I'm going to start painting the squishy and I'm going to start off with the skin color. And because I don't have a peach fabric paint, I'm mixing white and orange. This is a tip you could use for the hair, so what I did is get my scrap sponges and I mixed that in with yellow paint to create more volume to the hair. And here is the finished squishy. I don't really think it turned out really well, but I tried. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe if you haven't and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!